Hello everyone and welcome back again to U.S. Defense. In today's episode, we will discuss about the U.S. Army owns the world's most powerful laser weapon. Before watching, please like and subscribe to the channel. Enjoy! Lasers are currently used to shoot down small drones, but a more powerful weapon could take on larger targets. The U.S. Army is planning to demonstrate a 300-kilowatt laser weapon, its most powerful ever, next year. General Atomics Electromagnetic Systems, DEEMS, and Boeing are building the device, which is the size of a shipping container and mounted on heavy truck. The high-power, compact laser weapon will produce a lethal output greater than anything fielded to date, Scott Forney, president of DEEMS, said in a statement. The U.S. Navy deployed the first high-energy laser weapon, known as LADWS, on the USS Ponce in 2014 with a reported 30-kilowatt output. Most military lasers tend to be in the 30 to 100-kilowatt range, which is mainly useful for shooting down small drones. So the new weapon is a significant increase. Typically, such weapons are based on multiple industrial fiber lasers, with the output combined into a single beam. The new weapon instead uses large slabs of glass connected in series. Such slabs have previously been hard to use due to waste heat and issues with beam quality, but Geems says connecting them in series solves these issues and removes the need to combine beams from multiple fiber lasers. The new laser is part of a U.S. Army project to develop defensive lasers that can shoot down incoming threats. Last year, it demonstrated a 10-kilowatt laser defeating small mortar rounds. Justin Brock at UK security think tank Royal United Services Institute says the more powerful laser can take on bigger targets as well as engaging multiple targets in quick succession. It will allow the system to engage a greater density of incoming threats and also potentially engage threats, which offer a shorter engagement window, either due to speed or very low altitude flight trajectory, says Brock. This might allow the laser to defend against ballistic and cruise missiles, as well as drones, aircraft and helicopters, he says. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoy the video. Please like, comment and subscribe the channel. See you on the next videos.